What is going on, everybody? Here, this is your Pleasant Nickelodeon fan, Jason Alexander Pleasant, right here, right now, giving you another episode of what I like to call Nick Picks. I am so glad that you guys, I am so glad that you guys came. I cannot wait to answer some of you. I cannot wait to answer some of your questions. Oh my goodness, I am really, oh my goodness, I am really, ex oh my goodness, I am really excited because as you may, as you may notice, I am in my, man, I am in my, my Fresh Beats getup. Do you want to know why? Do you want to know why? Okay, listen. Okay, listen. The reason why I got this getup on right here it's because I have a very, and I mean very special guest. I have a very, very special guest. I don't know what. I think she's going to be coming in a few seconds. I don't know when. I don't know when she's going to be coming. But let's see what we, but let's see. Let's see what questions we, let's see what comments we have here. Hey, Skeletal, what's going on, man? Hey, Chris14.0, Allison Clark, Astoria Doodle, what's going on? Real Doodle, what's going on? Haley Garrett, Haley Garrett, what's going on? Epic X, glad you can make it. Epic X, glad you can make it. Caden, Caden Wells, nice to see ya. Caden Wells, nice to see ya. Okay, hold. Hold on, give me a, give me a minute. And I see, and I see that she's all, I see that she's already in the comments. I see that my very special guest is already in the, is already in the comments section. But, but apparent, but apparently she's supposed to be in the, but apparently she's supposed to be in the stream with me. But any, but anyways, I'm gonna give her a little, I'm gonna give her a little time for her to come. I'm gonna give her a little time to come on. I'm gonna give her a little time to come, come on. I'm gonna give her a little time to come on. So just, so just be patient, guys. Just be patient. I am I am really excited. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, okay. Before I say, before I get too excited, I want I wanted to I want to tell you that I am that I am my in fresh beats get up right now. You want to know why? Because as I told you before. I got a very, very special guest coming onto this stream for this episode of Nick X. She has been a big part of my childhood, and I cannot wait to, to show her to you guys. Everybody, give it up for the Marina of the Fresh Beat Band Season 3, Miss Tara Perry. Hi, Jason. Tara Perry, everybody. Tara <laughs> Perry. Season three's Marina of the Fresh Beat Band. That's right. Oh my goodness, it is an honor to have you here. It is, it is an honor to have you here. You, my friend, have been a big part of my childhood, for real. Ever since I've been watching the Fresh Beat Band all the way from seasons one through three, I have been checking out the choreography nonstop. I've seen you do some moves too when I used to do the caffeine live shows. I have seen you dance and you're a really good dancer. Oh, oh thanks. Oh my goodness. I, I, can, you believe, can you believe this? Tara Perry! Can you believe this? Tara Perry in here! In and here on the stream! Oh my goodness. Can you play, can oh you play the guitar and bass as well? Excuse me? 
Can you play the guitar and bass as well? I can. That's I can. <laughs> In fact, I have I have been messaging Th Thomas Hobson about about that little about that little thing that I that if any of the members need a bass player, that I'm your guy. But since the show is over, that didn't happen. <laughs> and anyway, Alice, Allison said, t "Hey, Tara." Hey, Allison. Oh, Skel Skeletal Hunt says Jason is a dancing machine. I've seen it multiple times. All right, all right, guys. I know that Tara is here right now, but we got. But listen, this is a Q and A. So if there's any, so if there's any question you want to give to us, or either one, or either one of us in the stream, feel free to leave it in the comments. Make sure you you use the hashtags in the description below. But any, but anyways, Tara. How, how have you been doing all these years? Ever since, ever since the Fresh Beat Band has uh, broken up. Um, I've been doing great. I've been doing a lot of um, acting on uh, films and stuff. I've actually written a lot of movies and TV shows, so I'm staying active, even though you guys might not see me on Nickelodeon anymore. But I am, yeah, just busy working and and staying safe and indoors right now. Wish <laughs> Twist could probably adjust himself for social distancing. <laughs> for those of you who haven't who haven't seen John Beavers and Yvette's latest post, they just oh my god, they just made the memories come back. They just made the memories come back. Yeah. First first Tara did the call, then it was Tom, then it was Thomas and then John John and Yvette. I was like, oh my God, the prophecy has been fulfilled. <laughs> if you guys ever get back together if you guys ever get back together, there has got to be a fresh beat reunion. Oh, that would be so fun. I know we would all love to get back together. We're all very good friends and we see each other whenever we can. Yvette has been in New York for about a year and a half now because she's on Broadway doing the show. Um, what was, what's the show called? It won a bunch of Hades Town. She's in Hades Town. And so she's been doing that and being really active. And, and John has been uh, on TV shows like Animal Kingdom. And actually, the movie that I wrote with my husband, Jordan, and filmed this summer stars Tommy Hobson. Of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> oh, Allison has a question for you, Tara. How did yeah, you get involved Allison. with the Fresh Beef Band? Sorry, what was the question? How did you get involved with the Fresh Beat Band? Oh, I see it, it's on the screen, oh neat. Um, so I just went in and auditioned. It was October 2010, so 10 years ago, next month, uh, I had the audition and I went in and there were probably 20 or 30 other girls in the waiting room and that was just for the 15 minutes that I was there. They had been seeing people for days, weeks. So I think they auditioned about 500 girls to do that role. And I had set, oh, this is my dog, Bonnie. Hello, Bonnie. Oh, nice dog. <laughs> I have seen a lot of posts on your dog. I have seen a lot of posts on your dog. And believe me, it is adorable. It is adorable to the T. We do love our doggies. And um, so, yeah, it was a very long audition process. I went in um, and had several callbacks. And as they got uh, from 500 to 100 to 50 to 20 to 15 to 10, uh, and then it got down to three people. And when you audition for a TV show, the very last step is called a test. And it's called a network test. So you have all of the executives from Nickelodeon and a bunch of people sitting around and they're all watching you. <laughs> and I got the job on my 25th birthday, which was super fun. Yeah. Oh, speaking of the speaking of the old and new Fresh Beat, have you met have you met the classic Marina Shana Rose before? I have. I actually met Shayna in an audition room for another television show. We were auditioning for, um, I don't remember what it was. This was several years ago. Um, but I recognized her from the first couple of seasons, and she recognized me from just being cast in it. Um, but, yeah, so I, I've only met her the one time, but I've, I've never hung out with her. I know Tommy has talked to her several times after, but I hear she's doing really well, and she's getting back into the entertainment business. Well, Kane and Wells asked you, Remember the Nick Jr. show called the Fresh Beat Band of Spot? Oh! Yes. <laughs> I love.
love of course she does. I love the cartoon. It was so fun. We actually recorded it just up the street from my house so I could walk to work, which is really lovely. Um, it was really fun because we got to work with Tom Kenny. That's SpongeBob. SpongeBob. You're, you're joking. You're joking. No. no. The actual Tom Kenny. Yes. Oh, my God. So Tom Kenny is uh, Bo Monkey. And he also plays Reed, and he is several other characters. He is uh, Champ Von Champ Von Wiener Champ. He is lots of different characters, and he is so nice and so funny. Hip hop and pop, the surprises just won't stop. <laughs> okay, Caloric Leader Nine asks, "What inspired you to become an actress?" Ooh, good question. Um, I always wanted to be an actor. When I was a little kid, I loved making people laugh. Um, my parents were big supporters of me doing acting. And so when I was in uh, junior high, I auditioned to do some community theater and I booked my very first audition. And it was a musical called uh, Will Rogers Follies. And then I did uh, theater in high school, uh, dinner theater. And I moved to Los Angeles at 19 to come out here and give it a shot. Mm, I see. Oh, Allison, ask you this. Are you familiar with the movie Selena that stars Jennifer Lopez? Because I can sing in Spanish. Wow, yes, I do know that movie. That's a wonderful movie. And that's great, Allison. I wish I could speak Spanish. I don't speak another language. I can only speak English, sadly. But I, I do have a goal in life to become fluent in another language. So I better start studying. <laughs> Epictron asked you, what was your favorite episode to do on the Fresh Beat Band? Ooh, uh... Wizard of Song, for sure. Speaking of the Wizard of Song, some, someone asked a question related to that episode. Did you love dressing yeah. up as Dorothy in the special? I did. I loved that episode. That episode, actually, uh, if you've seen it, it's longer than a normal episode. So it's it's about the length of two episodes. Normally, it would take us two days to shoot one episode. And this one took all week and a little longer, actually. So uh, I loved all the songs and I loved all the choreography. I really, really loved all the dance moves that we got to do in that. <laughs> and I think, I think the writers did a really wonderful job of creating the Fresh Beat Bands version of The Wizard of Oz. It was a really fun episode to do. Okay. Chris, ask you this. What was your favorite Fresh Beat song? By the way, you did such an amazing job on the show. Oh, thanks. Oh, thank you. Um, you know, well, hold on, Tara. Before you answer that question, yes, I thought it would be nice to bring Chris along in with this stream here. Do you sure. mind? Sure. <laughs> you better get ready, Chris, because you are coming in. <laughs> All right, Tara. You. All right, Tara, you can answer your, you can answer that question. All okay, right. let me think. Um, you really know what song I really love is um, I really like "Surprise Yourself." Um, that's a really that's a really great song. "Surprise Yourself." I also love "Great Day." I love that. I know. Believe it or not, so good. Believe it or not, that was the. Very first Fresh Beat song I have ever learned the choreography to. Really? The first Fresh Beat song ever. Amazing. In the history of the Fresh Beats. And um, let's see, the I think I've Been Looking for a Friend Like You is also such a, a really wonderful song. I love that one. I, oh, man, I was re I was really struggling with the choreography, but I'm still going to be checking Checking it out. And I see that Chris is already already. Hey. Oh, hey. oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Tara Perry from the Fresh Beat Bands. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I love your shirt. Oh, thank you. It's my Marvel shirt. I wow, this I gotta tell you, this is my first time that I ever met a celebrity before. I, I gotta tell you. <laughs> well, thank so nice you. Epictron asked you, Tara, what was it like working with Yo Gabba Gabba? Wow. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh, so, I that episode. Fun. <laughs> A really, really fun episode. I love, I love Yo Gabba Gabba. I love the music. I love the characters. And I loved getting to hug Broby. 
Oh, oh that, that is that so was... nice. <laughs> what was my first Fresh Beat Band episode you, I have ever Ooh. watched? Okay. Hmm. This, is no, this is no joke, y'all. This was the very first episode I have, I have watched ever since the series dropped. Whoa. Stick together. <laughs> Stick together. All the way from season one. Wow. Season one. I have been catching up with the Fresh Beat Band from seasons one through three. Wow. So, <laughs> you know what? Um, oh, sorry. Sorry. Go ahead. No, I, <laughs> I, knew I, I, I have never I, went to a live concert. Oh. Yeah. So, you know what? My uh, first um, episode of the Fresh Beat Band was it was, um, what was the, uh, the episode title called? Uh, where they, uh, did the marching band? Oh, oh um, I think it was season March away. I think, I think that was March or away. Yes. I think that's the one. Yes, that's the yeah. one. Yes. I love drumline and I love drumline music. And I, they oh, did, I think that was I love drum. I love drumline myself. Yeah. That is so cool. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Oh, um, Stephanie asked, what was your favorite scene to do with Yo Gabba Gabba? Ooh, that is a good question. Ooh, there was a scene outside that we filmed, um, and it was when we were look we were looking for. I think were we looking for um, what's the robot's name? Were we looking Plex, for someone? Plex. 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 Yeah. Yes, that the one that we sang outside. It's the big park. It's actually the same location where we filmed part of the Yellow Brick Road on the Wizard of Oz. Um, I love that one because it was such a beautiful day outside and. Like, Getting calm outdoors is really fun. Bonnie, Bonnie's coming back for a little more attention. <laughs> Guys, what could be inside Gear? What could be inside Gearmo's? No, no, it's the last thousand. I think. <laughs> Guys, what could be going? In what could be going on inside Plexus' tummy that's making such a racket? Yeah. <laughs> It's Guillermo. He's come loose. Oh. That's what must be causing Plexus hiccups. <laughs> that Guillermo always causing trouble. <laughs> That's right. Oh my God. Wow. Now I'll never be able to stop hiccuping. <laughs> that explains everything. That is perfect. That's right. <laughs> okay. Okay. I know. Oh, looks like Chris must have. Must have oh, went off into the stream. Good. Went off for the stream for a minute. Maybe, maybe he probably returned. But any, but anyway, okay, he's back. But anyway, yeah. Sorry about yeah. that. I don't know why I, I don't know why I just accidentally clicked okay. the wrong button. But okay, I, I came across a couple of, I came across a couple of comments about, about the Brett. Oh no, I can't. Again. I can't hear. You can't hear. What? You the can't. Uh, I think he. I think he has to put some earbuds on. Or, there we go. Maybe. Any, anyways, I came across a couple of comments in in the comments mm -hmm. section about the Fresh Beat Band, but I want to know if Tara knows the answer to this question. Okay. Uh, all right. Some of the fans already know this, but what was the Fresh Beat Band originally called before it was the Fresh Beat Band? Whoa! Way back. <gasps> I know it. The jump around. The jump around. The jump around. We got. We got the answer. <laughs> yes. Our, all right. All right. Our, Arctic Lord. I fifteen. Okay. Here we go. What's your opinions about each character of the Fresh Band in Yo Gabba Gabba? Oh my goodness. Um. One of my opinions. Well, I. Love Twist. He's so goofy and he's always there for you when you need to laugh. Twist. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Kiki is always there on your face and no matter what, she is the best friend and she will always sing the most beautiful song to make you feel better. And of course, my, my dear, dear shout is my just one of my best friends in the whole wide world. Um, and I, I just, I, I love getting to hang out with Shout. Uh, let's see. And for Yo Gabba Gabba, I was talking about Broby earlier. Broby, doesn't he just look so soft and just, just, he's like a big old teddy bear. And um, Plex was really, really funny. 
Uh, Plex was very, very funny. Um, <laughs> I'll, I'll to work with the most. <laughs> this is too. This is too fun. This is too fun. Okay, hold on. Let's let's see. Do you remember the first Fresh Beats song you have ever learned? Ooh, uh, let's see. That's a really good question. <gasps> oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, Tara. Allison said, don't forget the junior beat. <gasps> oh, the junior beat. Oh, can't we forget the junior beat? Of course. And, and their junior beats, I love that they had the same costumes, but they were just smaller. <laughs> yeah, even it's a little different, though. Yeah, it's, I get it. <laughs> a little mini me. Junior, the junior beats on the show, they got talent. They yeah. got so talent. They sure do. And and most of them are all still still working, still acting, and doing all kinds of projects. Wow. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Yeah. Wow. Okay, let's. Okay. Oh, and I think the first song that I learned was "Great Day" because I performed it during the audition. I had to do it oh. during. Oh. Yeah. Let's see. Okay, hold on. Let hold on. Let's see. Let me scroll up. Let me scroll up to see if there are any. Okay, so I got a question for Tara, for Tara. Um, um, have you heard of this uh, classic Nick Jr. show of Blue's Clues, but they did a reboot this yes. year? Have you seen the new one? I, I gotta tell you, it was, well, more than amazing, but fantastic. I good! Yeah. Oh, that's so great. I haven't seen the new one, but I hear it's really good. Oh, you should definitely watch it. It was, well, Awesome. <laughs> awesome. I'll check it yeah. out. I'll have to see All it. Right. Ooh, do I like Lazy Town? <gasps> I know that my husband and I, anytime I'm baking, we sing, it's a perfect day to make a pretty cake. <gasps> oh, <man. laughs> oh, my goodness. That, that was a good song. Yeah. Oh, okay, the Sports Fan 5 asked, if you ever had a chance to be on Broadway again, would you? Yes. <laughs> I love musical theater. Who doesn't? Um, any musical artists? Have you been inspired by? Oh, any musical artists? Hmm. Oh, that's a good one. Um, I love all music. I couldn't even tell you that I have a favorite artist. I just love music. Um, I loved the Beatles. I love listening to the Beatles music. I love uh, Beatles. Beatles, the Beach Boys are fun, the Rolling Stones, John Coltrane. Uh, I love classical music. I like listening to Beethoven and Mozart. Yeah, that's really great, especially when you need to study. I love listening to film scores whenever I'm writing. I no listen scores. to movie scores and I like trying, I like, yes, Bonnie, hi. Sorry, my dog is begging me to, do you need to go outside? <laughs> I'm like, do you need to go? It's very close to her dinner time, so she starts to let me know what time it is. Um, okay. Do I like Michael Jackson? It, Michael Jackson songs are very, very, very catchy. How can you not dance to Michael Jackson? Come on, come on, come on. He is awesome. <laughs> who does not like Mike? Who does not like Michael Jackson? I mean, not me. I I do like Michael Jackson. <laughs> oh my! Oh my goodness! Arctic Lord Fifteen asks. What's your opinion about Barney and Friends, Blue's Clues, Sesame Street, and The Wiggles? Did you ever watch those shows? Hmm. I was a little, when Barney came out, I was in school already. So I wasn't home when Barney was on TV. So I didn't get to watch Barney very much. Hmm. Um, and let's see, what were the other shows? Um, Sesame Blue's Street, Street uh, Blue's Clues, and, 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 and. Oh, yes. Oh, and Sesame right, Street. Yeah. I love. Sesame Street. I still love Sesame really? Street. I love it, love it, love it. I love Oscar the Grouch, and I love, I love Big Bird. Big Bird is such a good friend, and I love Bert and Ernie. Nice. And of course, Elmo. Yes, yes. <laughs> oh, oh, Tayden asked, "What is your favorite Nick Jr. movie?" Nick Jr. movie? I'm not oh, sure if they have any Nick Jr. movies oh, yet. That was actually, that was that was actually targeted to Tara. Me well, I yeah. Are there any movies? I didn't know that that Nick Jr. made movies. I don't, I don't know. know. I, don't, I don't even know either. I'll well, have to do my research. Well, I think I may have heard about they're making a movie about Paw Patrol before. Oh, oh fun! I know yeah. they made a Dora the Explorer movie. Did you guys see that? 
Oh, I've heard <laughs> of that. Movie. Of course. How could I not miss it? Yeah. <laughs> And you guys might be too young for this show, but did you guys watch? Did you guys watch um, Rugrats? And oh, yes! Um, yeah, I, yes! I've heard of Rugrats before, but I never actually watched it before. But... Oh, it's really good. I they made a few Rugrats. movies. I was born in '94 when the show was still popular out there. Oh wow! Yeah, so the Rugrats made a couple of movies, and those movies were really fun too. Hmm. Okay, Gage asked Tara. Remember the big comfy couch? I do. Mm. Yeah. You do. Uh, I oh. do. That's awesome. Oh, oh. oh. Did you miss? Oh. Oh, oh I think. Oh, sorry, it, it's got. Uh, Carson oh. asked. Carson asked asked me something. Uh, I think I might have missed. I think I might have missed it, but it's got it's gone now. Sorry, Carson. But any but anyways. Oh, Savon. Oh, Savon. What's going? What's going on? The members of the press feed. Hi, Savon. Yes, I do. They're all really good friends of mine, so I talk to them a lot. That oh, is a good thing. That is yeah. a really, really good thing. Oh, yeah. Zeke is that ask, do you still play drums? If so, oh. can you and Jason write a song together? That Woo! would be so awesome. <laughs> I do still play the drums, but I don't have my drum set set up at my house anymore. Oh. Uh, my, I know the only place I could do it would be my garage, and my neighbors might not be happy about it. But my friend <laughs> Matt has an electronic drum kit that whenever I go over to his place, I get to play on that some. That is, that is really good. Still got the drum and vibe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bad guys be ready for the super rock steady. Yeah. <laughs> get more superhero, baby. <laughs> okay, Tara, before, before we sign off around here, there's, some, there's one little video I want to share with you. I have made this for fan purposes only. Oh, wow. Let's see it. Oh my goodness, I cannot believe that I'm sharing this with you. Are you ready for this? I'm so excited. Time to get the beat, press beat. Hey, what's up? Oh, I, I know that. I love to sing and I love to dance. Whenever I get the chance. With the first beat, then it's number one. I wanna Are you ready to roll? Because here we go. Rock out with Jason and the rest of the first beat, man. Weekday on Nickelodeon. Oh, yeah. That is so awesome. Believe, believe it or not, believe it or not, ever since you came onto the scene of the Fresh Beat Band, that was the very first Fresh Beat song I have ever learned the choreography to in season three. Wow, that's amazing, Jason. That video is really good. Oh, hang on two seconds. Um, okay. I wonder what she's. Oh, Jason. Um. Just to let you know, uh, Isaiah just asked um, that um, that that Tara and I wearing the same color, wearing the same color. Oh we my are. god! <laughs> yes, we are. <laughs> blue t-shirt team. Yeah. <laughs> blue blue t-shirt team. Right. Okay. Oh, Tara. Oh, Gage asked you, what's your favorite childhood book? Ooh. Um. Ooh, good question. I loved when I was a kid, I loved reading The Secret of Nim, and I loved Charlotte Webb. And I love <laughs> I know so good. Books like The Giving Tree and Where the Sidewalk Ends, um, and scary stories to tell in the dark. Mm. <laughs> Very interesting. Yeah. Well, I think well, I think we got our we got time for one more, more question. Yeah, let's do a few more one questions. One more question. All right, Zach, Zachary and Autumn Brugen asked, would you ever wanted the Presby band to have toys like they, toys like based off of the Doodle Bops and the Wiggles? Yes! How fun would that be? I wish we had toys. You know, I wish we would have made musical instrument toys. And so people could have like little Fresh Bee Band drum sets and guitars and keyboards. and. Oh, yes. That yes, was really, yes, yes. That was really so cool. To make music. 
That would really yes. inspire the kids to make music. Yes, it would. Oh, Isaiah um, said you should check out my play alongs sometimes. They're amazing. Oh, I watch all of Jason's stuff. He's such a talented guy. He dances and he sings. What's oh nice my god! Oh my god! That, that, is, that is the main. That is the main reason why I give you almost every single shout out at the end of my play along video. <laughs> oh my goodness! I, I am so touched right now. <laughs> but, any, but anyways, I think that's all the questions that we have here today. Chris, thank you so much for joining along with Tara. And Yo, Tara, thank you so much for being a guest here on Nick Tech. So, thank um, you for so having where me. Can any, where can anybody find you? Where can anybody um, find you? Well, I'm on Instagram at Tara Tara Fofara. Jason, you are on it. That's my Instagram. I haven't posted a lot this summer because this summer has been very busy for me. And uh, with all kinds of stuff going on right now, I haven't been very active on my social media. But I'll get back to it soon. Um, and yeah, so I'm around. I, uh, I'll let you guys know more about um, movies and stuff that I'm in. There's a movie that I'm in that I produced uh, last year. It comes out October 2nd. But it's a horror movie, and it is rated R. So I don't know if a lot of your viewers would want to watch it. Um, no, it's no, yeah. probably a little too old. Um, but yeah, I'll always let you know, Jason, whenever I'm up to something, and you can share it with your fans as well. No problem, Tara. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for coming. Absolutely. Huh. Nice to meet you, Chris. Nice to meet you too. Yeah. What a great stream. Bye. Yep. What a great stream. Yep. What a great friend. What a great day. A great day. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going to get out of here. Tara's going to get on out of here to feed her dog and probably take her, take him outside for a walk. And, yeah. and Chris probably has something, probably has something else to do, but I don't even know. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.